The most densely populated country in Africa, Rwanda has taken giant steps towards healing from its tragic history of war and genocide. With more than 40% of its citizens under the age of 14, it has a strong incentive to plan for the future. The government has embraced urban planning as a key to help stimulate economic development and to alleviate ethnic and social tensions. It has assembled global expertise to advance several sustainable development projects that serve as a groundbreaking model in sub-Saharan Africa. The ambitious Kigali sub-area plans revitalize and rebuild the capital city. They concentrate on green systems, including wetlands and urban parkland, and sanitary issues such as waste removal, recycling, and environmental treatment zones. The plans protect indigenous wetlands and steep slopes and encourage higher density and mixed-use developments. Four high-priority sites include Ribeiro, once the residence of the ex-president whose death triggered the genocide, is transforming into a resort conference center with a neighborhood support center. Kimihurura, the gateway from its international airport, features a sustainable urbanist design with commercial space, hotels, a walkable mixed-use residential neighborhood, and greenways. Kinyinya, a prototype town center, uses sustainable urbanism to alleviate poverty and increase social cohesion. And Masaka incorporates large and local scale plans into a prototype urban center of sustainable urbanism. APA is proud to present the Pierre L'Enfant International Planning Award to the Kigali Sub-Area Plans.